This is going to be a video tutorial on how to change the size of your artboard. There's many different ways you could go about doing that. Uh, one of the easiest way, ways is to use your artboard tool. Your artboard tool looks like a square with uh, two lines coming out the top left side of it. The uh, keyboard shortcut for it is Shift plus O. Hold down Shift and press O. But uh, if you click on your artboard tool, your artboard now has a... Uh, blue dotted line around it and you can pull out from the corners and you can reshape it however you want to reshape your artboard. Another way to change the size of your artboard is to when you're on the artboard tool double click on your artboard and it brings up a little dialog box where you could change the uh, name of your artboard up here. Uh, you can change the width and height if you have a specific uh, dimensions that you want to use you could change it right here. Another thing you could do, like say you have this uh, illustration here, and you want your artboard to fit to it perfectly. That's uh, real easy to do. It doesn't matter if you have your uh, object selected or not. Uh, you can click off it if you want. It doesn't matter if it's selected or not. But uh, click on your artboard tool, and then simply click on your... Uh, object and now there's an artboard that is uh, perfectly fits right around your artwork and from there you could still change that as you can see it's got the blue dotted line around it and you can also say I want to get rid of this artboard I'll just click on this one selecting this artboard and I'll just hit delete on my keyboard and that deletes that artboard but that's what the artboard tool does you could also go over to your properties panel to do it a different way and select artboard artboards over there. If you don't see it over there, you just go to Windows and down to uh, Artboards, and you'll have this little box pop out. And from here, you could add another artboard. And what this did, it, it duplicated the artboard that I already had on here, but I could still change the dimensions if I wanted to. Say that I wanted to get rid of that artboard. All I got to do is click on that trash can there. Select your artboard. Now you have to have at least one artboard, but if you've got more artboards on there, you just select whatever uh, artboard you want to get rid of and click on the trash icon, and that deletes the artboard. I'm going to press Control minus to back up a little more. But that's how you change the size of your artboard. The way I normally do it is to use the artboard tool. And all you got to do is select the artboard. If you got more than one, you just select the artboard that you want to work on and resize it. Thanks for watching.